Concern right now. Two local hospitals are treating patients for a rare respiratory virus. We just mentioned this. These cases have not been confirmed, but the symptoms all seem to match here. WSBT's Kelly Stopsinski is here with the latest on enterovirus 68. So, Kelly, St. Joseph Regional Medical Center says it's admitted about 15 children for this strain of the virus. Tell us what we need to know. In just the last two weeks or so that's happened, Jennifer, primarily those kids are between four and nine years old. Memorial Hospital says it's seeing some of the suspected cases too. Doctors say EV68 peaked over the Labor Day weekend. So what is it? Well, doctors say the virus starts out usually very similar to a severe cold. Symptoms include fever and aches, as well as sneezing, coughing, and in some cases, a rash. Respiratory problems appear to be the hallmark of EVD68. Children with asthma are the most susceptible, but so far, doctors say this is not deadly. You can't get a vaccine for this, and no medications will treat it. Doctors do not want you to panic if your kids have a cold right now, only if they have trouble breathing. The best way to prevent EVD68, wash your hands and encourage your kids to do the same often. Tonight at 5, I will explain how Indiana and Michigan are surrounded by this enterovirus D68, yet the CDC says there are no confirmed cases here. I'm Kelly Stopsinski, WSBT Channel 22 News.